morning, y'all. Happy December. Happy Vlogmas. Okay, so it is Vlogmas. And what that means is that a lot of people in the YouTube community are committing to make a YouTube video every single day. Um, and usually these videos pertain to Christmas or whatever you're doing for the routine of getting ready for Christmas. Um, but my videos are just going to pertain to catching up on videos I ain't made that I plan on making and things like that. And every now and again, it'll be something like this where it's real time and I'm just showing you the boringness of my life. And so today's boringness is going to be cleaning my house. <laughs> I'm not cleaning my house. I have somebody here who is cleaning my house. But I want to show you what my routine is when I have the cleaners come in to clean. Normally there's about two people, but today there's only one person. Today is Monday and I would normally be at work at this time. What time is it right now? Oh, that clock isn't set right. So it's 8.26. I never did set it back. Maybe I can do that. Yeah. So that's what I do while the cleaner is cleaning. I go through the house and I co-clean with the cleaners. And so co-cleaning will look something like this. Let me show you guys what I will do. This is room by room. So each room, there's something that I can do. Um, because the cleaner's clean, but they can't necessarily put things up. Especially like today's cleaner. She's, this is her first time here. So she doesn't know where things belong. Only I do. So in this room, I plan on this area right here like this doesn't belong here i need to do something with this stuff here so this is the goal for this little room here that needs to be done too but we ain't gonna t mess with that today it's all good in this living room i need to go put that music stand right there back in the basement and in the kitchen what i plan on doing is unloading this dishwasher and getting this stuff clean now the cleaner will do it but like i said i consider myself a great helper so i'm a co-clean that's all i plan on doing in here oh and then over here i really do need to bring this stack of mail to work i'm so i am not the best when it comes to opening my mail so even my mail opening mail has to get written on my to-do list We're pretty good in here. Hey, y'all. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at my Christmas tree already up. Why is it up? Because it's been up all year. So I'm ready. Oh, we're going to give this water some plant. That's what I mean. Give this plant some water. That's what we're going to do in here. All of this stuff, I don't have anything to do in there. I don't have anything to do in the bathroom. Let's go upstairs. There's nothing for me to do in here in this bedroom nor is there anything for me to do in this bedroom. The person occupying this room opted not to have his room clean, so his door is closed. I am washing clothes, so that load just finished. Gonna get that over there. And then what I would like to do from this bathroom is throw these carpets in the wash. So I'm gonna do that today. In my bedroom, those are more clothes on my floor that I need to wash. I've just pulled everything out. So that's the laundry that needs washing. And then, y'all know, this is all stuff that needs to be unpacked in some way. But kind of, what I've been doing is cheating. So what I end up doing, if I don't get around to this stuff before she comes in to clean here, I just end up throwing all this stuff right back in that suitcase for another day. And again, this is more piles of things that need to be dealt with. I need to put these clothes up. This is clean laundry that needs to be put up. Hold on, let me move it. Y'all don't need to be looking at my panties. And then this is clothes that need to be put up too. Um, in my bathroom, what all I really need to do is put this stuff away. My everyday like makeup type stuff and the things I usually use every day and put those up they were just laying there drying up in my son's room i need to get rid of okay bottles and there's another dish underneath the little thing that's pretty much it and then this this stuff here so there you have it guys that is the plan that is the game plan 
and I'm going to go ahead and get started. I'm not going to set up the camera so that you guys can see anything. I feel like that takes longer than just actually doing it. Um, so maybe after everything is said and done, I'll show you the clean house. And so this is what I do. The cleaner comes every other Monday in the morning. So that's the day I just go to work late or whatever and get it together, get it together. Cause I refuse to spend hours. I tried it. I tried it, especially when I was, um, being really dedicated to this budget life. I tried doing the whole cleaning thing myself, having me and my son clean, but it takes hours, like four or five hours, and I don't wanna use four or five hours of my life that I could be using to make videos and playing with my friends to clean. So now that we don't have any debt, minus the mortgage, the mortgages that I have, um, I opened up a little more flexibility in my budget to make that a priority because I like having a clean house. It makes me feel better. It makes me feel good about my life. All right. See y'all later. Okay, guys, it is almost 1030 and the cleaning lady is almost done. Well, she moved quick um, because it hasn't even been two hours yet. An hour and 45 minutes. Um, she's downstairs, but it looks like she's almost done with the kitchen and it looks like she just may have some vacuuming left So I am running out to go to the ATM because I don't have any cash money I hardly ever carry cash money on me and I need some money to give her a tip And that's how it's all going and then after she leaves I will give you guys a tour through the house and we will see what was done and what I did more importantly we do what I did what I got accomplished in this good old day before going to work so I'm not gonna stay home finishing up things because I do have a job to get to so let's go get this money okay guys so the cleaner has left the house is clean now let me take you on a tour and show you what I did to contribute to this I'm super excited to have um made the decision to have my start having my house cleaned again because not only does it get to be clean every two weeks but also i get to go around and do some things things that i've been wanting to do meaning to do but haven't gotten around or haven't got made motivated enough to do it so when the cleaners are here it kind of motivates me to get some things done too so let's show okay so in my son's room the only thing i did was there were some dishes that weren't supposed to be in here. So I got those dishes and brought them down to the kitchen and got um, some empty bottles and brought them out to the recycling bin in his bathroom. So the cleaner did what she does up here. Down here, I did get two loads of laundry done this morning, as well as washing a set of carpets. Um, you know floor rugs or whatever and right now what I have going on is I have this washing machine cleaning I didn't want to start another load of clothes because as I said before I am on my way to work I didn't do anything in this room same thing with this room across the hall I did nothing so everything that was done in this room was done by the cleaner. In this bathroom, I did wash these rugs here. Um, they still look kind of grungy. So what I may end up doing one day is replacing the rugs all together. And everything else the cleaner did. In my bedroom... Let's see. I have wanted to get some more laundry done, but like I said, I'm on my way to work. So this stuff still needs to be washed. This is laundry. I just pulled it all out of this laundry basket. And um, so that I can either get them washed or get them to the um, dry cleaners. So that's what this is right here. Ugh. And as far as my room goes, this is laundry that still needs to be folded. So... We're not going to fold that because we have to go to work right now. And I did fold some laundry. And this clothes, I never, I didn't get around to going through these two bags of clothing here. 
I did kind of pick up some stuff that was laying around, right? But as we see, I still need to go and do something with the stuff that's here. And here goes this. Now, I did do the cheat. While I did put some things away that was like on the, this floor space right here, I did stuff the rest in this, in this bag because we had other things to do. So that's just going to have to be for another time. And this drawer, I like for it to stay open only because it's just too full. With This drawer is like my pajamas, workout clothes, things like that. And yeah, so that's why I have that open. And this stuff up here, I'm going to make a video. So that's why that stuff is up there for the video. In my bathroom, I cleared off my sink. So that's what I did in here. And then, of course, the cleaner did everything else. So, of course, I find with the art of maintaining a home that there is always something that needs doing. Like, for instance, I need to wipe that up. So there's always something that needs to be doing. And with having a cleaner come every two weeks, it makes me do it rather than just get overwhelmed. So in this room here, only thing I did was water the plant. The cleaner did everything else. Same with that room. Same with the bathroom. Same with this area here. Same with this over here. I didn't do anything. The cleaner did everything. And in this kitchen, I did the dishes. I put the dishwash, the dishes in the dishwasher up and put the dishes that were in the sink in the dishwasher and washed a pot or a pan or a frying pan. And in this room here, I did successfully go through everything that was on this couch. So that stuff is up. And that is about it. That is about it. I have a question for y'all because this always comes up. So for all, for those of you who have house cleaners, do you clean before the cleaner gets it there? Do you co-clean, co-clean with the cleaner? Or do you just do whatever and let the cleaner do its thing? Oh, and the other thing I forgot to mention, also while all of this was being done, I finished one video that will be coming up at noon today y'all it would have been already came up by the time y'all see this and i also finished um i started editing another video and i now i want to know what y'all do what's y'all's cleaning routine okay talk to me talk to me in that good comment section talk to me talk to me talk 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 talk, talk to me until next time i'm going to work y'all thank you guys who cared for watching and until the next video, the next idea, the next whatever, I'll at y'all later. And thank you guys for pressing the thumbs up button. Please press the thumbs up button. I just like seeing thumbs up. I don't know why people don't click thumbs up. Usually when I watch a video, not usually, all the time when I watch a video, the first thing I do is I just press the thumbs up button. Because, but you know. So press that. And if you want, subscribe. And if you want, turn on your notifications so you'll know when my videos come out until you don't know. <laughs> so later, y'all have a great Monday. Peace.